Hey guys, welcome back to my Pokemon Diamond Nuzlocke. And I'm in Pastoria Gym. I'm still just trying to solve this water puzzle so that I can reach Crasher Wake. So I'm, I stepped on that green button so that raised the water pressure, the uh, water level. So I have to look around for a new path that could possibly open up. But first here's a new sailor that I could battle. So I'm gonna um, switch Pokemon since Hope is pretty low on health. So I'm gonna switch Super Jai to the front so that he, he could take care of that sailor. So let's battle it out. I traveled all over the globe while raising Pokemon. This is the gym I've chosen. You'll find it a handful for sure. Nah, this gym shouldn't be too, too challenging for me as long as I got Super Jai by my side to take out all these water Pokemon in this gym. Sailor Damien, he's gonna send out his Wingle. And this this battle should be really easy for Super Jai. All I have to do is keep using Spark. Wingle is uh, flying in water, so it's times four weak against Electric. So there, down goes that Wingle. And he's got another Wingle that's going to be another victim to my Super Jai Shock. Wait, did I just say Shock? I meant Spark. I must have gotten Spark and Shockwave mixed up. So I'll use Spark on Wingle. So I'm finally done with Sailor Damien. You're kind of a top class tough. Yeah, and you're a third class uh, loser. So now I'm gonna press this blue button to raise the water level even higher. So now let's look for the next open path that I can uh, run through. And it looks like it's um, this way to another tuber. So let's battle her. I want to become a strong trainer like Crasher Wake. Yeah, don't you all want to um, be a strong trainer like him? So, uh, this is a tuber, Caitlyn. She's got two Pokemon. She's gonna start off with her Azuril, which is actually not a water type, it's a normal type. So, I'm just gonna go for Spark to destroy this Azuril. So that Azuro went down just as fast as it came out. Now here comes Meryl. So Super Jai's got this in the bag. As long as it uses Spark. So Nighty Night, Meryl. You are out of here. I've beaten Tuber, Caitlyn, Grown, you're too much. Yeah, that's right. Too much for you. So I'm gonna keep running along, and here is a fisherman. Hello. I've landed the most fish Pokemon in the world. I'm next. Yes, you're the next victim. That's what I like to see it as. So here we go, Fisherman Eric, and you have three Pokemon. So let's see him. So he's got a Goldeen. So I'm gonna use Super Jai. Keep on dominating with Spark. So your Goldeen is not gonna last in this battle. Super Jai gained 522 experience. Now here comes a Bar Boach. And uh, I'll let Hope in on this. I want to share the, spite the spotlight. So I don't want Super Jai to take all the credit. So Hope use Return. that Barboach is history. 
So now he's got Gyarados, so I definitely gotta switch Pokemon. The only thing that could handle that is Super Giant. No, so my as long as I got Super Giant against Gyarados, I shouldn't fear. So it has the Intimidate. So I'm gonna go for Shockwave since it's a special attack. It's not affected by its uh, Gyarados' Intimidate. And that should be a definite one-hit KO. So see you later, Gyarados. Wasn't even able to touch my Super Jai, so Super Jai gained a level to 31. Which is excellent. Being number one in the world doesn't mean a thing. That's right, because you're not number one anymore, I am. So, the, this is the next button I need to press, so let's step on it. So the water level uh, went down again. So it looks like the only way I can go is down. So I think um, the, this is the new button I need to press. Well, wait, there's two buttons. Wait, can I go this way? Yeah, I could. Uh, let's see, I'm going to try this button. Oh no, that lowered the water pressure. So that didn't look like the right choice. So I think to correct that, I'll need to go back and press another button, which is this green button. So let's press that to go back to um, how it was. I think I was supposed to press this orange button. And no, it doesn't look like that was right either. So I'll uh, press this green button again. And let's see. Let's press this orange one yet again. Yeah, maybe I was supposed to press that button. So uh, I'll go around. I think I'm supposed to go down here. And let's see if there's any new buttons that I need to press if I run around here. And this one will take me up to these stairs to another trainer. So yeah, this is the correct way to go. Like the raging sea, I crash down and wash away everything before me. That's just how I roll. Yeah, you'll be rolling alright when I'm done battling you. So I'm challenged by Sailor Samson, and he's got a Shellos. Which is one of those Pokemon that vary according to where you catch it. If you catch it uh, on the west side of Sinnoh, I, I believe you, it, its color stays pink. If you catch it on the east side of Sinnoh, I think its color becomes uh, green. So that Shellos went down. So here comes another one. So Super Jai is just fine, um, staying in this battle. Here comes his next Shellos, another pink one. So another Spark should do it. So that's a dead Shellos. So Super Jai is um, getting a lot of experience in this gym. Here comes another Wingle. Not a problem for Super Jai. It's just gonna terrorize on um, this gym with Spark. So it was a critical hit. That was just for the uh, the laughs. So I've defeated Sailor Samson. That wave didn't even wash my hands. Yeah, I didn't see any wave, um, buddy. So. Yeah, there's no waves crashing down on me in that battle, so I'm going to press this uh, blue button, and this should take me directly to the gym leader, after I cross this bridge. And here is Crasher Wake. So let's get started. Welcome, I don't get challenged very often, 
The glory you are now beholding is the Pastoria Gym Leader. That's right, I'm Crasher Wake. My Pokemon were toughened up by the stormy white waters. They'll take everything you can throw at them and then pull you under. Victory will be ours. Come on, let's get it done. So that's the ever so confident gym leader of Pastoria City, Crasher Wake. Who believes in his, um, his water Pokemon. Because he's trained up in the seas. So Leader Wake sends out his first Pokemon, which is a Gyarados. I'm going to send out Super Giant, which is my best chance at defeating Wake. So my Super Giant is going for the Shock Wave, because of that Intimidate, Spark wouldn't be a good idea to use, because it's a physical move. So Shock Wave should completely decimate this Gyarados, and that was a one-hit KO. One down, two to go. Super Giant gained a lot of experience and gained a level to 32. Great job. Now here comes Quagsire, and that's something that Super Giant can't, um, can't damage with its electric attacks because it's part ground, so I'm going to have to switch. I'm going to switch into Hope because she has Grass Knot. Let's go, Hope. And here comes Leader Wake and his Quagsire. But Hope doesn't have enough energy, so I'm going to have to heal her up with a Super Potion. Super Potion for Hope, and it's going to be very much healthy. So Quagsire Slam missed, so Hope is just that epic. So I'm going to go for Grass Knot. So, way to go to use that Quick Claw, to go ahead and use that Grass Knot, which is times 4 super effective on Quagsire, and that was a one-hit KO. Awesome job, Hope. So here comes his Floatso, his strongest Pokemon. So now it's time for Super Jai for... Time for Super Jai to take out his Floatso for the grand finale. So Floatzel's the evolved form of Buizel, and his Floatzel's at level 30. Hey, that there, that was a good move. Yeah, that sure was. So I'm going for a Shockwave, but Floatzel's faster, it used Swift. Use Shockwave! Alright, let's see if Floatzel it will be able to survive that. No, it wasn't able to, because... Super Chai is just that good. So I've beaten Crasher Wake. Oh, uh, it's gone and ended. How will I say this? I want more. Yeah. So I've won. It seems the Undertow put me, pulled me under. But I had a great time battling with you. You've earned this. I've received the Fen Badge from Wake. Awesome. My Super Jai pulled through. You need that Fen Badge to use the hidden move Defog outside of battle. This is a special reward for me in recognition of your team's power. Obtain the TM-55. So you mind telling me what that is? It's Brine. Inflicts double the damage on targets with less than half their HP left. Use it to end battles decisively. So I emerge victorious from Wake's Gym. Alright guys, so thank you all for watching my Pokemon Diamond Nuzlocke. Comment, like, sub, and, and I'll see you guys next time.